Guys, um, this video is for you if somebody typed in the password on your uh, smartphone and you don't know what it is or if you've had your phone for some time and the last time you typed in your password was I don't know maybe three or four months ago and you don't know what it is then uh, this video is for you Um, and so what you want to do first is go to your Wi-Fi settings and and so here I am connected to the network called uh, Fire on Stone um, and so what I'm gonna do is uh, do a long press and then uh, choose modify network and here um, what I'm going to do is show advanced options and click on IP settings and then static. Um, this will differ depending on what your Android uh, version is. Um, and so, you know, I say it, it'll, it'll vary. Um, And so here, um, what you want to look for is the IP address for your router. Um, this uh, right here is the uh, IP address for your router, um, and it's called Gateway. Um, generally, it's either 192.168.1.1 or 192.168.0.1 that's the most common one um, in this case um, this is my like my second router and so um, this is the IP address for this router um, but go ahead and highlight that and copy it and what you want to do is go back to your home page and uh, go ahead and launch you your browser in this case it is Google Chrome um, and go ahead and paste the routers IP address onto there and go ahead and uh, click go um, And so now what you want to do is uh, go ahead and launch Google Chrome or any browser of that nature, what you prefer. Uh, I guess in this case, it's Chrome because of the default browser for, uh, for Android. Um, and go ahead and paste the router IP address and go ahead and uh, click go. Um, and here, uh, you want to do is use the login information from your router to log in the uh, you know the settings um, most of the time the username is admin um, and of course to verify exactly what it is maybe most of the time is the if you look at the bottom of the router um, and there's a label there and it actually tell you what the username as well as the password for the router um, and so go ahead and type in your username um, and then go ahead and type in the password as well and uh, click sign in and of course each router is different there's like hundreds of routers that are available um, and so your user interface can vary um, depending on what router that you have and so I guess in this case, I had this Asus RT N1-2D1. Uh, um, and what you're looking for basically is um, the SSID or the network name that you are connected to. Uh, and most of the time, it'll actually tell you it here on the advanced settings. Um, you know, in this case, it is wireless. And so what you want to do is look at the settings here. In general and um, as you can see there's only one SSID 
uh, or the network name in this case that I was connected to is Fire on Stone. And what you want to do is uh, scroll down and look for the e-password. Um, it'll tell you, you know, like a label here. Um, it'll either tell you, in this case, WPA pre-shared key or sometimes it'll actually tell you uh, say password or something of that nature um, and this case is generally about you know maybe about seven eight uh, characters long uh, in this case it's fire on stone 91 um, like I said it's each each router is uh, can vary depending on what router that you have and uh, like I said, this the password for this one is Fire on Stone 91. And so there it is, guys. Um, if you like this video, feel free to uh, like and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you next time.